next drill we're going to do is called two and a half slide drill. Um, Jack's going to demonstrate the drill. Uh, one of the concepts and important points to remember on this drill is to accelerate quickly with the hands past the hips. Okay, so Jack is on this drill going to take two full strokes, fly, breathing, and then he's going to take a half stroke um, as he pulls his way down into a dolphin dive. So it's very similar from the drill um, that you saw before, um, only this time he's taking two full strokes prior to the dolphin dive. Uh, what Jack's going to do is keep his head low um, when he takes the breath, and he's going to pop the hips up. He's going to pop his butt and drive his belly button in towards his spine as he goes down into the dolphin dive, trying to keep his hands extended as far as possible as he catches water and, and literally hooks into um, acceleration forward and down. So he takes two full strokes and then he generates a lot of propulsion downward and forward. And we're not looking for a lot of undulation on this. Good low breath, good timing of the kicks. So again, we want to be taking two breaths, one, two, and then a half stroke diving down. Okay? And what this drill is going to really emphasize is it's going to force you to pop the hips. Okay? You're going to get your belly button in towards your spine, you're going to press your hips up, and you're going to undulate slightly down. Okay? So the goal of this drill is to allow you to pop the hips without having to do a ton of undulation. One of the key points of this drill as well is to uh, keep your head down when you're undulating. So it's two breaths up, and then when you take that stroke and you're diving down, you want to keep your eyes fixated on the bottom of the pool. And as your head goes slightly down, your hips are going to pop and your belly button's going to come into your spine. And you're really going to feel that uh, up kick kind of accentuate. Two and a half slide drill. I'm going to go two strokes breathing. And then one quick pop, driving that head slightly down. Uh, one of the things I tell my athletes uh, on this drill is to think of yourself as having, having a, 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 a ram or a horn on your head and the horn on your head is kind of driving forward as if you were ramming the wall or ramming something in front of you. So if you've got a, a kind of a point on the top of your head, you're kind of driving that forward. And what that does is it kind of emphasizes you to get your chin down a little bit and as that head goes down and as your chin goes down, your hips are naturally going to come uh, ascent to the surface. Keeping good tone and keeping your belly button in towards your spine is one of the things that can help uh, make that drill a lot 